that's a wrap on Wonder Woman 1984. On Sunday, the movie's leading Lady Gal Gadot, 33, posted a message of gratitude after she finished filming the highly anticipated Wonder Woman sequel. Get push notifications with news, features and more. Follow following you'll get the latest updates on this topic in your browser notifications. We did it. Again. Get it wrote on Instagram Sunday. And as much as the first time shooting Wonder Woman was amazing, this time was even more unique and special. We shot in four very different locations and countries, and I'm so so proud of the almost 1,000 crew members who came to set every day, giving everything they have into our movie. In an accompanying slideshow, Patty Jenkins, who directed both movies, talked into a megaphone as Gatta cheered. Another photo showed Jenkins and Gadot setting up a shot in a mall, and the last image showed Jenkins pointing across the landscape as Gadot looked on. Gadot offered kind words for Jenkins. Couldn't ask for better partners on this, Gadot said. I'm so lucky to have the one and only Patty Jenkins as my director. She always has our backs, she gives us the wings to dare, and every day she helped us find the most creative version of ourselves. I am so grateful to call her my friend. And to our amazingly talented cast who made every day enjoyable and fun, thank you. Gadida added. One of those cast members is Chris Pine whose character Steve Trevor appeared to die during Wonder Woman's dramatic climax. Pine surprised fans by popping up in a still from the sequel set in June. Pedro Pascal, who has appeared in Game of Thrones and Narcos, is set to appear in the sequel. Kristen Wiig is also on board, as Jenkins confirmed in March on Twitter. Honestly. Words cannot describe this experience, Gaddick wrote. This journey was so demanding and challenging, but we all came and did our very best every take, every day, putting our all out there, and I'm so proud, thank you universe for this opportunity. I love this character. And thank you to all of you for being the best fans in the world. It was you that made me push myself every day. I'm so happy and excited, can't wait to share it with you in 2020," she concluded. Wonder Woman 1984 is slated for a June 5, 2020, release, according to Weekly. In 2017, Gadda talked to people about the impact she hoped the first Wonder Woman had. It's amazing that girls are exposed to the visual of strong women that are fighting so beautifully and having this amazing sisterhood relationship and caring to each other, but yet they can hold a sword and ride a horse," she said. But you can't only empower the women, Gaddick noted. You've got to educate the men too. This movie is for everyone. It's for boys to go to the movies and see that women can be amazing and badass and strong and inspiring, and not only me.